Well, hello, YouTube and RV fans. Thank you again for tuning in. Now, I must apologize. I've been a bit remiss in not posting videos much lately because I've had several uh, photographic and video gigs that I've had to attend to in my professional life. And um, so I've been traveling and doing this, that, and the other thing. And, uh, of course, I need a little bit of personal time, which uh, I enjoy when I can, of course, like anybody else. But uh, I know Just Incredible has posted this on his YouTube channel. And uh, it's time for me to do a shout out and start talking about this too and uh, beating the drum. Uh, now we're talking about RVCon first annual. No, I know earlier Just Incredible posted a video talking about the first annual RVCon. Now it's a blend of ideas between the two of us. Uh, he, he had thought of a, a concept similar to that. And I, of course, I came up with the idea of we should do this, but where we should do this to avoid hassles. Now, RVCon, number one, is tentatively going to be late August or September. And uh, I came up with the idea of that we should do it at Peace Arch Border Park. Now, for those of you who aren't from the Pacific Northwest, uh, Peace Arch Border Park is one of, uh, one of the only uh, and unique, interesting border parks on planet Earth. It's a place where there is two parks on two countries that people on both sides can come and mix without having to have a passport or go through border regulation control. Now, that doesn't mean you can cross into the opposing country and stay there. No, you have to stay within the park boundaries. So, if you come up in your RV from uh, Washington State, you are allowed to come into Canada in the park area, hang out with us, and same with me, I can go to the United States. The reason that we picked that place is because it's got good facilities, it has, uh, it has washrooms, it has barbecue pits, and it alleviates any hassles for anybody in Canada or the United States to mingle. It's kind of like a hands across the border for RVers. And now there's a small uh, parking fee, I know Washington State Parks uh, levies. And uh, I think now there's a levy of a small fee for parking on the Canadian side, because the parking area isn't actually part of the park. It's uh, one of the uh, local uh, Aboriginal bands controls that land. Now I'll tell you where that's gonna be. You guys can Google this and do some research if you're interested in attending. Uh, dates yet to be set. I want you guys to know that, folks. So this is the uh, Peace Arch Border Park, and uh, it is at the at the top of Interstate 5 in Washington State in Blaine, Washington. And that's Blaine, B-L-A-I-N-E, Washington. And the, uh, the Interstate 5 becomes Highway 99 on the Canadian side, which technically is uh, Surrey, British Columbia, Canada, which is a part of Metro Vancouver um, area. So... Me and Just Incredible have some uh, details to work out and a little research to do and kind of finalize when. And we would love to invite all you YouTubers up here. Now, of course, we're going to try to have Nomadic Fanatic come on up because he's a local boy. He's a Pacific Northwestern guy uh, from the Olympia, Washington area. Just a few hours drive. Now, Blaine, Washington, only about 20 minutes north of Bellingham, Washington. So it's not that far out of the way. So we would love to see you down there. And if I have to, I'm gonna come pick you up. So uh, let's uh, look forward to that. Do some plans, more information to come both on Just Incredible's channel and mine. And hope to see all of you, even if you're not an RVer, do a little hands across the border at RV Con number one. So in the meantime, folks, keep the wheels on the ground, stay safe, and I'll talk to you.